All right, everybody. Welcome to episode 22 of House Hyrule. We're playing Crusader Kings 3 with the Game of Thrones mod, the Viet mod, and the Abdication mod, which we added last episode. I uh, hope you guys all got to see it. I think it was last episode. Yeah. Um, if you look at our introductory screen here, you will see our in front and center, our main character currently. He is, he is Roski second of his name um to his right or to our right his left uh, you'll see his father Rill, um, who died when he was very young and then on his right our left you'll see roski the first who is still alive he's over in tawny bay doing his thing enjoying retirement um but yeah that's kind of what's going on um since our religion, the Weeping Werewoods, has ancestor worship and stuff, I thought this would be a pretty cool uh, image just to kind of remind, you know, uh, everybody of, you know, where Roski comes from. You know, he's probably thinking about that a lot himself. Uh, yeah. So, anyway, let's hop into the game. Um, like I said, I think at the end of last episode... Uh, we still have just a little bit of time. Our main character is 18. His betrothed is 11. Um, might be a good time to do a university visit. I'm not sure how long those usually last. I've never done one before. I think they're new. Uh, and this is that same tournament, right? Yeah, that we can't get to. Okay, yeah. So we don't worry about that. Um, this may be... I think that's new with um, the Wards and Warden update, which is pretty cool that it added a new, you know, activity that seemed to be more the purview of um, tours and tourneys or whatever it was called. Uh, but yeah, so let's just pop this up. We may upgrade our education trait, which would be pretty cool. Uh, we may gain skill points. Lifestyle experience. We may gain artifacts. We may recruit a highly skilled character. Um, yeah, let's just see. I, it will probably take us to Old Town, which is kind of cool. Because that is where our betrothed lives. So, let's plan a visit. And the university. Yeah, look at that. It's down in Old Town. So, we'll get to see Violet. Well, you know, if uh, in our head canon, it probably won't actually happen. But local faith is hostile. Let's see here. What dangers are we facing? Looks like mostly in the neck. Bog. So, let's see here. So I think we're going to need forest. And the bog is forder, right? No? Where is bog? Let's just try it. No. Uh, jungle? No. Mountaineer did a little bit. Desert does a little bit more, I think. No, Mountaineer does a little more. Okay, well, I guess we'll stick with that. Who's in our entourage? Oh, right, our uh, caravan master. Perfect. I think that's about as good as we are going to do. We plan to make the absolute most of it. Or we can try to p 
party. I think we'll try to study hard. We've got... We are the first in our family to actually go to a university. Um, I don't think university is necessarily how uh, the um, Citadel works in Old Town. I don't know if people just go there to study. I know that, you know, they train maesters. Uh, let's see here. This is going to cost a pretty good bit of gold. Let's see here. Wow. Well, I don't want to spend our entire <laughs> treasury on this trip. That does look like that's a lot of fun. Um, yeah, let's see here. We're going to be gone for eight months, so, so we should make it back uh, before our wedding. Um, so, yeah, let's just try it. This is pretty cool. Yeah, we're going to study hard. And let's go for it. All right. We're going to unpause. Uh, another thing I want to do in branch side, we're going to upgrade to the full warrior lodges. So that'll be good. All right. Here we go. I enter Rob's bedchamber, but I find the room absent of him. Scattered across his writing desk, however, I find a pile of half-written letters addressed to Old Castle. The letters are filled with details about my court, hiding places, who provides my meals, the names of malcontent servants likely to betray me. I turn back and see Rob standing there, bereft in the doorway, like a hunted animal moments before fleeing. So, let's see here. I can gain compromise security. Yikes. Or he can lose 35 opinion of me. Oh, da, 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 da. I can't be believe Rob is a rat like that. That's crazy. I was on the uh, the Rob bandwagon here, and then he had to go and do that. Hmm. We have a really good. Um, not here. We have a really good spy master. So. We, and we're brave so we may not be as concerned about that kind of stuff uh, this could be a mistake but I feel like that's what he would do is just you know try to work especially because he's so diplomatic try to work his you know his way around things so let's see here Okay, so uh, yeah, I, I must have arranged some marriages after the last episode. So yeah, we cleaned out the... Let's see here. So Clonald can try to help. Uh, and he may get injured, or I can jump in to try to help. Uh, and possibly get wounded. So this guy is being attacked by a wolf. He is Tantalorn. He's old gods. So he's not our same religion, but that doesn't make a huge difference. Like we're uh, we're kind of a branch of the old gods religion, basically. Uh, da -da 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 -da. 
I mean, Roski's brave. And you can kind of tell what the game thinks you are more likely to do by that'll make you gain stress, you know, if you don't do it. Um, yeah, that's fine. Let's go. Okay, so we beat the wolf. Our family is like uh, beast, beast hunters, <laughs> beast slayers. They really do quite a bit. Alright, and let's do this. Fill the coffers. Alright, so we're headed down. We've seen this event a few times. Uh, basically, this is a iffy bowl of stew. Are we going to eat it? Or are we going to... Uh, not eat it. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. This really doesn't affect too much. So we're outgoing. We're adventurous. This is a big trip for us. So let's do it. <laughs> we get nauseating meal, of course. So look, we've got. Oh, never mind. Oh, this just must have refreshed that nauseating meal that we got originally. We've got nice prowess. That's great. So if we do get to go to a tournament, that'll be a good um, good thing that happens. All right. Let's see here. We've seen that event so many times. <laughs> Let's see here. So this is a shrine we can pray at. We'll just say a quick prayer. We're on the way to school. We can't be, you know. Doing too much. How old is my brother? 17. Oh no. Our steward is dead. That stinks. Let's see here. Who's our highest? We got a. 18. That's not great. Let's just see if we can replace her. Steward is one of those things that I prefer to. I prefer to, you know, keep with just a really high skilled person as opposed to a vassal. Uh, let's see here. Let's just see. Find spouse. She's pretty good. So let's just try a few more. He's our guest. He won't marry. There we go. She's only 42. So let's go for that. And actually, let's just check. Let's see here. We have a female. Let's just see if there's a higher male. Uh, he's about the same. So yeah, we'll go to here. And here. There we go. Died in her sleep. Oh, bummer. Hopefully that wasn't the result of any kind of issue. Why was she... I 
I forget. <laughs> I don't know. I forget why she was imprisoned. Can we ransom her? Oh, whatever. I guess she'll just stay in prison. I'm sure she did something bad. Alright, let's keep going. Are they not going to accept our... There we go. Excellent. Let's get her on the council. Boom. And she's increasing our development. I thought that was almost done. Seven years still. Oh... Do they just keep redoing it? Is that what's going on? Alright. So, travel. The macabre scarecrow of Rushdown. Strolling through the Rushdown countryside is not quite the peaceful lark I had imagined. The sky is black with clouds, and the farmland fields are deathly silent. That is where we hear ear-wrenching wails of agony coming from uh, from so this is in the Riverlands uh, coming from deep within the fields as we draw near we find a man strung up on posts as if he were a scarecrow from his dry lips and pale skin it is apparent he has been here for a while some of the men, members of my entourage implore me to cut him down but is this really my concern guess we'll show mercy I don't know uh, the man grovels pitifully at my feet bloodying the soil with his hands soon members of my entourage hoist him onto his unsteady feet pleading to hear how he came to be there oh I was just here to collect taxes the peasants told me the gold was buried out here and before I knew it they descended upon me and strung me up like a scarecrow uh, intellect is clearly not his strength, but he offers me a small sum of wealth for my assistance regardless. So, we can recruit him. So we can get a weak hook on him. I d <laughs> we can get 10 gold. For 50 piety. Um, I mean, we always need gold, you know. I don't know what we can do with this favor hook but it's fine alright let's head back to myself we are headed down to the reach it seems like the reach has swallowed a good chunk of the riverlands I don't think it was this large <laughs> Before, let's see, we can actually tell part of the Riverlands, yeah. So it is, let's see here. Uh, on a fine day like this, the weather is nice. The pastures of Daisy Field, oh, that's a nice name, uh, look great. And the local livestock are positively jumping and cheering in their own guttural manner. Calves are walking next to their mothers, uh, their fur shiny and clean. Overall, the place is very competently run, although I did notice a couple of oddities that I would manage a bit differently. The local matriarch approaches me. So she's 36. 
Uh, let's see here. So this is who we're talking to. Hellison. Uh, a fine morning to you, my lord. Are these beauties not a sight to behold? So, what we can do is... Try to improve things, and Loris will become our friend, or he might just like us even less. <laughs> um, let's see here. It's a stewardship challenge, which I am not particularly <laughs> good at. Uh, let's see here. But this would be good for us. Improved pastures. Yeah, let's try it. Yay! All right. So branch side is gonna prosper even more. All right. Yeah, we're just going to have to forage, spend a little prestige. Okay. Was there another Loris? Because this says Longshanks, and I think we were looking at Loris. The foolish, right? <clears throat> All right, here we go. I think we've seen this one time before. The massive chopping block in the middle of the logging camp in Dalefield has seen much use. It looks like it's always been there, even before man walked this earth. My shoulders are tense, and my forearm trembles slightly from built-up stress as I approach the magnificent wooden trunk. I carefully place a piece of discarded timber at the podium, and in one swift motion I will raise my arm. <clears throat> so I can try to do this, and possibly maim myself. Um... 7% chance... Like, we don't have a lot of stress or anything. I don't, I'm not really sure why we would do this. So I'll, I'll just gain a little stress. I know, like, we're brave, but that doesn't mean, you know, we have to do literally everything. There's High Garden. Oh, our Regent does not do well. That's okay. They're not going to be in there for that long. And they have a really high uh, aptitude. So. We are almost to Old Town. You can see there I am. We'll say a quick prayer. Alright. So we are doing some studying let's go time to get started all right so let's do this what do we have going on here we go Universities and centers of higher education are always bustling hives of socialization. In these hallowed halls, the students are all peers, all apprentices along the pa uh, road to knowledge, which is why it can be helpful to make fins, friends and feel part of a community. Uh, these, at least, are my first thoughts when Edmund, so he is a crown lander, approaches me, the smell of meat on his breath, Join me and my friends, Roski. Prove to us the might of a lord 
by downing more cups than anyone else, and we shall consider you one of us. So I can do a diplomacy challenge, which will give me this buff. Let's see. Gives me some connections for 10 years. We lose stress, and we become slightly more successful. Uh, or we can say no thanks. Uh, da, 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 da. We are solitary. So it seems to say that like we wouldn't necessarily do this. Um, and this isn't really offering any kind of... Uh, you know, permanent buff. Ten years is a pretty good long time. Like, we'll be 28. Um, but I want to see... Okay. So let's go. So here we are noble student we've got a Wyman but not the Manderly type <laughs> alright this is one of those things where it it, it just doesn't really make sense because I'm already here. Um, five years is not a long time, really. So we'll just do that. It's fine. Like, it seems like a long time, and we're playing on slow, but it really is not a long time. I wonder if we can befriend you can't befriend children interesting so he's a teacher he got more proud of me I like checking these little events that pop up here Admin. All right. Interesting. The Starry Sept is a renowned center of studies that hosts both teachers and students from far and near. I hardly thought much of it until today when a religious reference from Wyman struck me hard uh, as blasphemous and contrary to everything I've ever been taught in my life. Uh, it revealed him as a worshiper of the seven. An actual heathen, and I don't know how to feel about it. So I say, I don't care as long as he has something to teach. Uh, and this is because of my study hard intent. Yeah, it's definitely good if you go to school to kind of, you know, keep an open mind, but also keep a pretty solid foundation. So, architected ancestry. What does that mean? What does that mean? Ah, I should have clicked on it. Architected ancestry. We're pretty close to unlocking that. I have no idea what I just unlocked, but <laughs> it's fine. Uh, yeah, who knows? All right.
so he's another student he's 49 so we're pretty young uh, we're in much older company so we're doing great as far as experience goes all right teaching at the starry sept takes place for the most part in oral form and students are encouraged to exercise their rhetorical prowess uh, and to show the progress of their learning in debates in front of their peers and teachers. Today, Mandon, is this Mandon? Oh no, he's our teacher, I guess. Has asked me and Edmund, who's just really high learning, uh, to take opposing sides on the topic uh, of what planet should be considered the most important to discuss it out. Let's see here. So we can do this because of our study hard intent, or we can do this. Um, well, this is a win-win. You know, we do gain some stress if we lose, which is seems like it's a higher chance because of this is a learning challenge, and he has high learning. But you know what? Let's try it. Lost the debate. Ah, well. What happens? Let's see here. A wonderful phrase. <laughs> All right. The children are once more at play in the courtyard, and today they are engaged with their toy swords. Rob seems relentless with the other children, taking several of them at a time and besting them with ease. Uh, this is a this is a uh, reminiscing thing for John. Uh, he would always take more than one person at a time um, as a night's watchman. He would he would always fight more than one person. So that's kind of cool. Okay, so I can lose 200 renown. I do not want to do that. That's an insane amount of renown to lose. Uh, I want him to be loyal to us, but yeah, whatever. <laughs> we should have other opportunities. I'm not giving up renown for that. So we are cleaning up diplomacy lifestyle, which is good. Um, I'm a little worried. This doesn't seem to be going up very quickly. But hopefully we, you know, in four months get a chance to improve it by a lot. Uh, let's see here. It's so crazy. We're so close. Oh, for guardianship. This is so weird. Yeah, we'll not accept. Uh, Alright. Let's see here. I am suddenly distracted from my midnight studies by a loud crash, an ear-deafening slam, and an expensive-sounding shatter. What in the world is going on? The source of the... Disturbance appears to be two peasants. God knows how they got in here, ravenously gulping down a barrel of the university's invigorating herbal infusions. Uh, okay, so they're drunk. This'll <laughs> teach them, one of them shouts. Yeah, they think they're better than us just because they can read. <laughs> okay. So. Uh, so I can say, poor unfortunate souls, um, I will see that you learn how to read. I can spend some gold and teach them how to read. Uh, okay. I could, <laughs> I could hire them as servants. Um.
Oh, look at this. This Lady Michella. Our future mother-in-law. Let's see here. Spend 25 gold. These guys both get their in in learning increase, but like I would prefer for us to have our learning <laughs> increased. Um, neither of them are particularly great. And I don't really want to pay. I don't want to become less successful. Jeez. Um, this will guarantee we become more successful. I mean, we, you know, whatever. We're already spending money to, to try to do this, so let's do it right. gotten up to the decent studies more successful like the the success score goes up so slowly three months left <laughs> we gotta crank this thing up if we're gonna make it guys we gotta get up to here I don't know. I don't know if we can do it. Our learning is not super high. I mean, it's decent. It's good learning. All right, let's see here. The halls of the University of the Starry Sept often echo with the debates of students and teachers, some of us some of which escalates into notorious rivalries between like between Wyman and Mandon. So these are both teachers, I think. And I really hate this <laughs> the glasses. Um I don't know if that's historically accurate or whatever, but they just look really weird to me. Uh when I find them today they are as usual screaming at each other, trying to prove whose field of study is better equipped to discuss what geometrical shape is more apt to represent the divine. Something less usual, however, is that they suddenly notice me approaching and ask me to take a position. So, <laughs> uh, there's a 36% chance we'll get massively more successful. Uh, or we could just play it safe. 36 isn't terrible. Um, let's see. He's decent. So, I would like to do a, a massive more successful, but like there's a chance that this does nothing for us, you know. Whereas this at least definitely gives us something. And it's not slight, it's it's a good chunk. So it's, it's good. Basically we have two months left. It doesn't look like we're gonna make it unless something just pops up here and really takes the cake. We have studied hard too, and we've done a lot of the little side challenges. But, you know, sometimes it's just not in the cards. I think with our learning, we should be able to do a little better than this, but that's fine. Maybe we'll get to two.
I mean, we're not getting a lot of events from this. So there's not a whole lot of chances to prove ourselves unless, you know, things pop up here. All right. So here's another event. The Starry Sept is often home to fervent debates among teachers and students alike. Uh, after a particularly enlightening lecture from our teacher Wyman, I find myself dragged into one such debate with another student, Kale. That's this guy. No, you're making no sense. You're completely misrepresenting the philosopher's point. I scream. You are completely delusional, he fires back. From the corner of my eye, I see Wyman stare at us with a pensant look on his face. So, we can do this, which is good. Yeah, let's go. Okay, so we're really close. Hopefully we get at least one more. Now, what's this? being raided I'd like to get the ability to raid that would be some great money some good income okay 15 days come on let me at least get to two <laughs> let me at least get to two Ten, nine, eight. Oh no. Come on. Yeah, I think we're not gonna get anything. What a bummer. This is kind of disappointing of uh, event, all things considered. All right. Well, at least we. Um, got a diplomacy perk. So, Wyman will join our court. And he's a decent character. So that's good. Well, we... We didn't increase our Let's see here. Yeah, so we're trying to get this anyway. Let's see. We'll do this. We should have enough to unlock this before we're married. So that should be fine. And then this will be really good to get Patriarch. And this will be great too. Every child we have will give us a random skill point. So that's going to be great. The diplomacy is interesting. I don't think I like it as much as learning. Uh, so, I mean, some of them are pretty good. They're just not 
there's nothing that really makes me, you know, excited. So we might do... I don't know. We might just do this and move on. Because we, you know... I don't know. It's, it's not very exciting, I guess. Best way to put it. So let's move on. And that, that university visit was not very exciting either. travel tip the host the afternoon is quickly advancing into nightfall as we enter the local farm estates of Al aldenley the estate owner r grave greets us warmly and promises to host lavish a lavish feast for us once the feast starts we dine on a veritable menagerie of roast animals stews soups bread and the like in the morning our grave approaches me as I enjoy my breakfast, my lord, hosting such an such an extravagant shindig as yesterday, can be expensive. So, <laughs> uh, she already really doesn't like it. Look at this. Um, she is from a bastard house. So that's interesting. She's from a bastard branch of the uh, Gardner House, which is is a big deal among like the first men, which you know is a big deal in the north. Uh, let's see here. I don't really care if she doesn't like us. She already doesn't like us, so we get twenty five gold basically for free. And I don't really care if she becomes a rival. We're probably never going to see her again, <laughs> to be honest. So it's fine. Um, that gold will definitely help more than whatever. So. We're just trucking along. All right, so we all know this event. In fact, I think we still have, yeah, the healing water, which, you know, really doesn't do much. It's not worth all the fuss, and you can't break it for gold <laughs> or anything. Um, but let's see here. We don't get him anyway, so we might as well just uh, have him join, you know. That's fine. Alright, so chivalry is alive. And we are not doing any kind of cultural deviations for Roski the Second. We did all that with Roski the first, so we are going to keep it good. Alright. I hope my brother's okay. He's still over there. They're not going to let him back. Maybe we should do some kind of 
have our spy master like search for secrets or something over here. We need to get a hook and get my brother back. Let's see here. Council. All right. So we can possibly get Gardner, which will be nice. Or down to earth for 10 years. We spend some prestige, but we have a ton of prestige to spend. That could be a good trait to have. So we're going to do it. Yay, nice. So that helps our, our stewardship be a little less pathetic. <laughs> uh, that's good. And then once we're married, hopefully that'll be, you know, we'll be decent at, at all that good stuff. Oh, nice. Okay, so we got the shortcut. Uh, at right. And I was about to do... Let's look for secrets. She's good. So if we get a hook, we can get our brother back, which will be good. So our, the faction against us disbanded. Wonderful. There was an event that popped up here that I didn't see in time, so hopefully it wasn't a big deal. <laughs> the bad end strikes back. So that's fine. So we can... Just ask the locals or eat the moldy food. We'll just ask the locals. Yeah. I'm curious to see. Let's see here. Improved pastures. That's great. Our income is looking a little better. And. This is almost done, though that won't improve our income, so never mind. But we do need to get some uh, uh, petition or liege. Let's see here. Oh, uh, maybe I can't ask him for anything. Maybe we already have higher development than Winterfell. Possibly. Yeah. <laughs> so we are very developed in branch side. back here we go wonderful so we got some good experience there good deal she didn't get us any gold did she wow that's fine all right so yeah I think that was pretty disappointing maybe if you have high learning or maybe if you're in like the learning lifestyle, uh, that might be better. But it was kind of garbage for us. So, and I feel like it should be good for everyone, you know. But if I do it again, maybe with high learning, it'll be better. <laughs> Uh, 
I'd like to see like a tournament pop up or something. Yay. Let's see here. Let's do this because we are going to get married. You know, not super soon, but soon enough. Okay. Ice Mark House. I think we've seen that. But it must be just like a randomly generated one because that's what it looks like. Do, 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 do. It's nice that our family likes us so quickly, because that can be a pretty, uh, pretty rough thing to have happen. Let's see here. Violet is. Let's see here. She's fifty. So he would be her heir, right? Yeah. We're about to be, or we are allies with them. Uh, is she our friend? Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah, we can totally do this. Let's join the hunt. So this is the dangerous place. Let's see, and that's a st steep step. So that. And then Taiga. We could do just like a forest guide right and then customize route to do like that and that like that and then on the way back that and that uh, and that, there we go, <laughs> okay, so activity starts and we should get there nice and early, that's good, our caravan master, master got hurt, so, yeah, let's join the hunt, this will be a good, Thing to do and let's look for more secrets I can't wait hopefully he's okay so geez he is ill I can't wait okay so we're still finding secrets here We got our feasting halls completed. So she's 
79. Mystic. I can have her tell me my fortune. I mean, I wouldn't mind taking her, but these um, older people, they seem to croak pretty quickly. Um, and we'll just do this. How insightful. Wonderful. All right. Good deal. So we are now faithful. So we were resting along the road in Flint's Bine when a traveling Tantalorn bard. So she's a bard. That's pretty cool. Now she's chased. What? And ruthless, golly. Um, so a Tantalorn bard happened to pass by. She introduced herself as. Uh, Ale Aleandra Lachere. Uh One of my guards offered the woman a few coins in exchange for some entertainment. Aleandra then sang through several songs in the local common tongue dialect. There was little doubt about her talent. Uh, the melancholy songs touched our hearts deeply and the joyful songs roused our spirits. That's really cool. So I could say thank you for the performance. And lose a little bit of stress. We don't really have stress. I could. Basically. Yeah. It's fine. Thank you for the performance. We're going to try to find a. Secret on Lady Fresnel. All right, so we were going to go for a hunt. Arthur assembles the party as the sun rises over the camp. Uh, in the wetlands near Ragged Hill, the local gamekeepers have scoured the, the vicinity for recent tracks and fumes. There's clearly a small roebuck nearby, but no... Uh, recent traces of larger game ultimately uh, Lord John decided he wanted to hunt the roebuck that's fine so just a small oh interesting alright it's a lovely day for a hunt which means it's a nice day to be outside. As I fill my lungs with the fresh air of the wilderness, I spot in the distance what can only be a gift from or, to nat or nature's dedication to our God, uh, the listening high God. Our health, the God of health. So many useful herbs and beautiful flowers, both for healing and malicious intents. But I'm here to hunt. Picking tulips may raise some eyebrows. So... I can keep up uh, appearances. I can do this, which lowers the chance. But I do gain some learning experience. And I become the owner of Pressed Poppy. Uh. So, and then I could do an intrigue challenge. <laughs> uh, which doesn't affect the hunt at all. 
Um, well, whatever. Let's just try it. <laughs> Did I get anything? Yeah. All right, so. Espionage while performing. Okay, good. Unbelievable. So, let me just pause this real quick. Oh, no, am I in the wrong place? I'm supposed to be at Keystone. Okay, yeah, yeah. So I am in the right place. We just... Yeah. Let's go for more secrets. <laughs> we still haven't gotten Lady Fresnel. Let's just see if I can get my brother back or call. No, no hook on Lady Fresnel. Can we blackmail her or anything? Maybe if we befriend her. Maybe she'll give us our brother back. She is 30. We can try that. 46 cents. Yeah, well, let's try it. All right. So as we follow the quarry into the swampland, slowly but surely gaining on the cunning row, it suddenly spooks, hurtling away in another direction. And as I move to see what scared it, I can scarcely believe my eyes. Balder and Samyard entangled on the ground in a passionate embrace. So I can back away slowly. And they will both like me more. Tanalorn. So these are Lord, Lord John's men. Uh, I can do... I can do this, which will give us a higher chance, hopefully. Oh, wow, that is a very low change. <laughs> I don't think that we are going to much here all right so press poppy uh, we could I wish we could do something with this stupid healing water <laughs> it's garbage uh, but we'll unequip it and we'll equip the press poppy because that's that's better um, Actually, let's see here. My tooth. This has a lot of years left. We could destroy this. We could destroy. That's my dad's tooth. But it doesn't have a lot of time left on it. And these are all, you know. Yeah, let's just go there. We'll we'll keep it somewhere else. We're just not gonna keep it equipped on us, right? Okay. So twenty eight days till the hunt is over. Do I have any hunting skill yet? No. Maybe I'll get some from this hunt. All right, so he's going to try to surprise the row. All 
I can be like, listen, my family can teach you all you need to know about killing animals. We've been doing it for generations now. Good job, Leon. Oh, look at that. It kind of brought us up a little bit. So, despite our best efforts, we were unable to get close. Uh, okay. That's fine. We're just here for the recreation. But, again, just because it says we failed doesn't mean we failed. It can still pop up. So, as happened, gained some prestige, gained tr hunter trait, perfect. That's all you can do. Finish the hunt. Perfect. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> we know tons of secrets um, a lot of them have to do with you know illegitimacy so people just not having a lot of self control I guess and we're about back home perfect We'll see if any other events pop up. Let's not do this. Let's abandon this game. Let's just do a regular sway. Okay, we can't do that. Um, Let's do just a regular sway. Perfect. And if she likes us a little better, maybe she'll give us our brother back. Because I miss the guy. You know? So this is going to be great. She's getting there. She's almost old enough. Um, <laughs> so we are finding just a ton of secrets. But none of them are... Lady Fresnels. Maybe we should go intrigue for our next lifestyle. Oh no. My brother has the pox. Well, I guess I don't want him back right this second. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. I feel like I remember there being like a... Uh, People have to pay gold or something if you have a secret on them. 
But they may have taken that out. It might be too overpowered. I don't see it. It might be one of these. Yeah, I don't know. There might have been stewardship, maybe. Oh, yeah. So we could try to go stewardship. Yeah, I don't know. We'll keep that. We'll keep all these things in mind, you know? It'll be good just to get our family all set up. We're I think we're going to do a grand wedding. Um, that'll be great. And this is another big wedding for the high rolls. Um, we have married into the Dane family, which was amazing. And now we're marrying into the High Towers, which is great. Oh. Is she a hostage? I hope not. I might have to rescue my... I have to rescue my betrothed. No, she's with her father. Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe they're on a trip or something. Who knows? Do, 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 do. All right, guys. Well. We kind of got to see a good uh, view of <clears throat> kind of what university visits are like. Um, we may do something like, you know, and we got to do a hunt, which is always fun. Uh, but we may do something like a pilgrimage or something like that before we get married. Maybe like travel all over the north and get all those lovely experience nodes <laughs> while we're still young um, we could really let's see so we're close with diplomacy again close with Marshall not close with stewardship got some intrigue and decent learning so a good long pilgrimage would be pretty great And I might just, like, switch over to Marshall. Like, I, I really enjoy having Gallant. Uh, there's just really no, you know, problem with it. And it's not that much difference as far as how much we get per month. So... Yeah. So yeah, we'll try to get our brother back next time. Hopefully he doesn't die of the pox. That would be very sad. So, but I mean it is Oh, yeah. He may die. Which would really stink. So, 
she believes there's still something going on. Let's try to do it. This lady's bothering me. She kept my brother and gave him the pox. <laughs> we'll blame her. All right, guys. So, yeah. Um, that's going to stink if our uh, brother dies. There's Royce. The princess of fashion it's really like we have a really cool family like you know you can kind of know everyone by their different personalities and things they've done it's been really cool seeing the family grow and i appreciate you guys watching and commenting along and all the likes and views it's it's really been awesome uh and definitely you know anybody watching feel free to comment anytime i love all of them um yeah and uh we will catch you next time thanks for watching bye